Hey guys, I'm Jessie and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be deep cleaning and organizing my bedroom. I'm really excited about today's video because I was really stressing out earlier and I was like, oh my God, I need to clean my room, but I also need to make a video. What am I gonna do? And then I realized I could literally clean my room and film me cleaning my room and just get both things out of the way. So I'm really excited. I also have not cleaned my room. It actually hasn't been that long, which is really gross because my room is really dirty. Um, but it's only been like a month or two since I cleaned it. So this is only like a month or two worth of me being a slob. <laughs> but I remember one time it was so bad that I opened my closet and there was like nothing hanging up because it was all on the ground. And yeah, comment down below if you have a really bad habit of like throwing your clothes on the ground instead of putting them back in the closet. I do it every single day. So even after I clean my room today, I know that it is not gonna last that long but I'm gonna enjoy it for the few minutes that I do have it clean. <laughs> okay guys, feel free to subscribe. That would really help me out. Um, let's get started. And then we have this ledge here with half dead plants, but it's okay. They're thriving with some love, sunlight, and water. They'll be good. So I have to clean this up and organize it. I have to organize that back there and all this stuff. There's this corner over here, which is literally just a pile of clothes that pile up over the week or over the month sometimes of clothes that I take out of my closet and put right here instead of putting it back or instead of putting it in the laundry basket. And there's just a random fan because I use a fan to sleep no matter what season it is. And then I've got my two tripods right here that I use for filming. And then we've got my mirror, this giant mirror. And then I need to clear off this. This just has a bunch of random little things. I need to make my bed. My boyfriend's side is like so nice and clean. Like obviously not perfect, but like this is his entire side and there's just like nothing there. Hi, Logan. Hi, baby. You wanna see hi? You wanna see hi? You're so cute. Yeah, you're gonna get all the ladies from this video. But it's so funny how his side is literally the cleanest out of this entire room. And then you go over to my side. Like the moment you step into my side, there's clothes, there's clothes, there's like garbage. Oh my God, I'm so bad. I think I'm gonna start with the obvious, which is like the huge bed. Okay, so I just finished making the bed and now I'm gonna move on to my nightstand area. <laughs> Which I'm really nervous about because I ran out of room in my closet a long time ago, which is a huge reason as to why that is on the ground and why that those clothes are on the ground. So, <sighs> yeah. that away. I'm vacuuming once all of this gets put away so I'm just gonna like wipe all this stuff onto the ground because it's all gonna get picked up anyway. One thing that I don't do that I'm so bad at is dusting and I don't know why. This is a picture of me, my mom, and my brother when we were super young, obviously. <laughs> That's me right there. Oh my gosh. Everybody's so young here, like what the heck? My brother. <laughs> Guys. Cute, okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
this is my childhood pet. This was Mocha. She is the cutest chocolate lab ever. Sorry if you have a chocolate lab, if you're offended, be offended. No, I'm just kidding. This picture is so crooked. I need to fix this. <laughs> There we go. Cutie pie. Now I'm just gonna like slowly take all this stuff out. I'm kind of scared because like this stuff has been back here for a really long time. Yo, what the heck? This is a whole thing of sleeping pills. Unopened. Oh, oh nice. How beautiful. A band aid. Very nice. Okay, so I just finished cleaning that off and that's what that looks like. Literally all my plants are in the middle of like dying and being revived. Like that one is coming back to life, it's lovely. That one, I swear this plant completely died. And then somehow, like, I don't know, I was too sad to throw it away and I just kept watering it. And then somehow it started regrowing back. I don't know, but, and then there's this one, which is so cute, but I accidentally like killed it. And I'm kind of hoping that it does the same thing as this one. and it just um, but yeah, so that's what that looks like now. By the way, these tiny little things that you see, like, they're permanent and I can't do anything about them. I just really wanted to point that out because I worked really hard in getting this room clean today and I did not want you guys to think that I just, like, left that half done. So I literally can't do anything about these things that you see and some of the stains, it's like paint chippings. Just wanted to clarify. So, so far, this is all the garbage that I've picked up and thrown away and that is so much. I'm just gonna like put it over here. So we're gonna do this corner next. Let me make sure. We got my nightstand, we got the side of my nightstand, we got the window, we got the corner. Yeah, so this is all I have left to do. By the way, I don't know what it is about having this TV on the dresser, but I feel like it's really ugly having it on the dresser. And I think it's because I really want to decorate the dresser and I can't because the TV is sitting on it. Okay, I'm gonna go grab the vacuum for the last thing that's left, which is vacuuming. So that was it for deep cleaning my bedroom today. Thank you so much for organizing and cleaning with me and sticking around to the end if you did. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm so sorry about the lighting if it keeps changing. It's because the sun is being emotionally unstable right now, but I ordered a ring light which should be coming tomorrow. So I'm really excited about that because then I'm probably not gonna have to sit in front of my window because I'm also very restricted. Like I have to sit right here in front of my window every single time I film. And I actually have box studio lights, but I really just, don't like that lighting so i'm going to try the ring light that is coming tomorrow so hopefully that turns out good but i really hope you guys enjoyed this and i kind of hope that this gives you some like cleaning motivation because honestly i watch these videos to get cleaning motivation to clean my room or my apartment so i hope that did something for you or at least i hope you enjoyed and if you did definitely give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below that would help me out so much and i would seriously appreciate it by the way don't worry about my plants i swear to you i've tried my best to take care of them the issue here is that my cat he likes to come in and like chew on them and eat half of it and then you know the plant starts to die because my cat is using them as a snack bar watering doesn't do crap so they just like look half dead and i just want to let you know that like i swear to you i'm trying to take care of these plants but my cat is so damn hungry like no matter how much this cat eats he still chews on my plants i actually google before i get any plant i google that my cat can eat it because I can't watch him 24 seven and I can't stop him from eating the plants all the time. So I wanna make sure that it's something that he can consume without it being poisonous. So all of the plants that you guys saw on the ledge, all of those are cat friendly and can be consumed by a cat. And actually the one in the owl, in the white owl is actually catnip that I got from PetSmart when they used to be tiny little like stems. That's how I got it from PetSmart and then I moved it as it was growing and then eventually it got into that owl pot. But yeah, that's catnip. Yeah, so that's it for today. Oh,